What's going on, people? It's your motherfucking man, Pyro XL, and I am finally back with some Black Ops 2 gameplay. I know it's been a few days since this game came out, but you know, I wanted to give it some time to sink in. You know, I could have hopped on here and done this video, you know, the night the game came out, but I didn't want to give you guys an opinion based off of two hours of playtime. Because I really don't think that's enough time to evaluate a game, you know, because I mean, some nights you do well, other nights you don't, and I wanted to wait until I had enough playtime in order to make an opinion. But, you know, I should probably introduce his gameplay and, oh, sit down, son. Look at me pick up these offense medals right here. Give me this beat flag, baby. And I'm going to hop up, kill this dude, too. But anyways, this game right here is a domination gameplay on the map Slum. Running an MP7. I actually really do enjoy using the MP7 so far. And I got five perks on in this game. You know, I decided not to run a secondary. You know, I don't need that shit. I can just pick up another gun if I want it. You know, so I got, uh... Lightweight in the perk 1 slot, and I went ahead and used perk 1 greed and put hardline in that bitch as well. I got toughness in the perk 2 slot, and as far as perk 3 goes, I got dexterity with perk 3 greed, extreme conditioning. Pretty good loadout right there if you ask me. You know, it did lead to this gameplay, which uh, the reason I decided to upload this, I got this like Wednesday night. And uh, this is the most kills I've gotten in Black Ops 2 so far. You know, it's 50 kills. Not amazing, but, you know, for me, it's the most kills I've gotten so far. And I'm running the low streaks, you know. So I'll take 50 kills with low streaks anytime. I do die a decent amount in this game, but uh, I really don't give a fuck. You know, I die like 16 times, but, you know, I'm playing the objective in this game. You know, capping flags, defending them. And uh, speaking of defending flags, man, I finished this game with 17 flag defense. 17! Ain't nobody taking my flags, man. <laughs> But anyways, I guess I should tell you guys what I think about this game so far. That's what everybody wants to know, right? Every time I get into a party on Xbox Live, everyone's like, Hey man, what do you think about this game so far? So I'm going to tell you guys what I tell all of them, alright? I'm a little bit disappointed in this game. You know, it has, it has problems that it shouldn't have. You know, I realize that it's a new game and, uh, you know, in about three weeks they're going to start patching some shit just like they did with Black Ops 1. Black Ops 1 was terrible when it first came out. About a month later they made a whole bunch of patches and the game got better. And that's gonna, it's going to be the same thing with this game. And I know this game is going to get better, so in the future, my opinion about this game might change. But as of right now, I am a little bit disappointed. And I'm going to give you guys a few reasons why. You know, I said before that this game has problems that it shouldn't have. And the problem I was thinking about when I said that was the spawn system. I don't know about you guys, but I've been spawn killed multiple times already in this game. I have about six hours in. I've been spawn killed a bunch of times. I've done some spawn killing. I've had people pop up right on my screen and just shot them right in the face. You know, so... I'm not sure what happened to the spawn system from Black Ops 1, where getting spawn kill was, you know, a once in a while thing. But, uh, you know, that spawn system, it wasn't perfect, but it was good. You know, Modern Warfare 3 spawn system was completely fucked up, and this one isn't much better. You know, I mean, it's better. You know, it's not as bad as Modern Warfare 3 spawn system. But like I said, I've been spawn killed, I've done spawn killing. And it's annoying as shit when you get spawn killed. Now, the reason this should not have been a problem in this game is because Treyarch should have known that... One of the things people complained the most about in Modern Warfare 3 was the spawn system, and they, they should have taken that into consideration and worked harder on making a better spawn system. But they didn't. That being said, I know Treyarch likes to patch shit, and hopefully they will work on fixing their spawn system. Now, the spawn system is one problem that this game suffers from so far, but it's not the biggest problem. The biggest problem that I've noticed is the lag. Now, Treyarch games have always had lag in them, but it just feels so much worse in this game. I mean, I cannot tell you how many gunfights I have lost due to lag all right we're talking you know I, I i fire two or three shots off before people even look at me and i still end up dying or you know you run around the corner and you see an enemy and you start to drop shot and on your screen you go all the way down to the ground shooting at him but then you still die and you watch the kill cam and for some reason this guy kills you before you even fucking crouch like you know the lag is fucking ridiculous that's all i'm saying it's just really annoying, you know, when, when you start shooting at a guy and your first two or three bullets don't even fucking register and then he ends up killing you because of that, you know? It's the type of shit that makes me want to stop playing, you know? But anyways, you know, I think that's the biggest problem that this game suffers from so far. Look at this guy. Sit down and then hit this guy with the drop shot. Thank you for the UAV, baby. Now, the only other problem that I've noticed in this game so far is the sound engine. All right, you can't hear shit in this game. All right, I wear a headset. A lot of people I play with wear headsets, and everybody is having problems sound touring in this goddamn game. I mean, people just walking right up behind you with no dead silence on, and you can't hear them coming at all. It's just really annoying, man. You get shot in the back, you watch the goddamn kill cam, and the dude doesn't even have dead silence on, and you're just sitting there like, why the fuck could I not hear this guy coming? 
I mean, that pretty much makes the perk dead silence useless, seeing as though you can't hear shit anyway. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, you know, those are just the main problems that I've noticed this game has so far. And I know it kind of sounds like I'm trash-talking the game already, but I'm not, you know? Uh, every time a new Call of Duty comes out, you know, there's major problems that it has. And as soon as enough people complain about it, they patch it. You know, it takes like three three weeks to a month tops. They'll have most of this shit patched, and the game will be much better than it is now. You know, I have faith that this game will continue to get better as time goes on, and I will grow to really enjoy the game. Because, I mean, right now, I've been getting really frustrated playing it. You know, I, I have had some good times on it, but for the most part, I've been getting really frustrated playing it. And other than the aforementioned problems, I think a lot of that also has to do with the UAV spam, you know, because, I mean, you don't get ghosts until level 50-something, so everybody is just running UAVs and goddamn random grenades. <laughs> I've actually been running counter UAV ever since I unlocked it just because of all the goddamn UAV spam, but, uh, anyways, you know, there is a lot of stuff that this game has done well, and there's, you know, there's stuff about this game that I do enjoy, but, uh, unfortunately, I don't really have enough time in the rest of this video to talk about that. I'll have to make another video! You know, and probably do that tomorrow or the next day and post it up here for you guys to let you know what I actually enjoy about this game. But in the meantime, I would like to hear from you guys what you don't like about this game. Since, since in this video I talked about the problems it had, you know, let me know in the comment section below what you do not like about this game so far. You know, it could be anything. It could be something that I listed before, you know, it could be a problem that's been happening to you that I'm not really aware of yet. You know, it could be the goddamn maps, which by the way, I'm not a huge fan of most of these maps. Just throwing that out there. <laughs> But yeah, guys, you know, let me know what you guys are thinking about this game so far. You know, as I pick up another UAV spy plane, call that bitch in. Gonna climb up on the middle here next to this statue, and god damn it! Another fucking random grenade, man. I've gotta start wearing flak jacket. I just unlocked that shit not too long ago. I gotta put it on. I keep getting killed by them goddamn hunter-killer drones, too, you know? And apparently rocket launchers, you little motherfucker. Oh my god. But anyways, you know, this gameplay is getting close to over, and look at this guy. Gonna hit him with the jump shot while dodging the Semtex at the same time. What a pro move! And I'm gonna drop that guy, too. But anyways, hope you all enjoyed the gameplay in the commentary, and if you did, don't forget to rate the video. It really helps me out. And like I said, I will be back either tomorrow or the next day and let you guys know what I enjoy about this game. And I'm going to pick up this double kill right here, which gets me to the 50 kill mark, picking up another UAV. But wait till you see the final kill feed, man. Look at his lightning strike. Oh my god, he gets all six of them. All six of them. But anyways, in this game, 50 kills. I do die 16 times, but I get 17 flag defends on that three bar. I'm out, guys. Peace.